Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hello, beautiful, gorgeous, absolutely stunning people. Carmen here, and welcome back to another episode of Solo Leveling. Today we are in episode seven. Last episode was so good for a multitude of reasons. Jean was fighting immaculate. Jean Ho's reaction to seeing Jean Mu's real strength. <laughs> So funny. He was so scared. He literally called out for his dad watching it. He was like, dad, come take me home. <laughs> I was so excited to see that reaction and it did not disappoint. As excited as I was for the revenge against those other fucking hunters that kept trying to murder them. I was like, okay, yeah, Jin Woo, kick their ass. It took me a second to realize that getting revenge on the hunters that betrayed them would probably mean killing them. And I absolutely fucking love how they did that because it wasn't just like, whoa, Jin Woo, you're so bad and you're just killing a ton of people. He actually was tormented by that decision. And we got to hear his perspective and emotions of like, even though it was in self-defense, I still just killed a fucking human. A person is dead because I took their life. And then he proceeded to kill five other people. So I was like, okay, character depth, showing his emotions, he's experiencing pain, I see you. And then to add to that, out of nowhere, they pull this fucking banger of a song. And it is not like, boom, fight scene, booyah. It is heart-wrenching, it's beautiful, but like that, I was so happy because I just posted a clip of my reaction to that scene with the music to it on TikTok and so many people commented and told me the name of the song. So you know what I did? I added it to my fucking library. I listened to it and I was like, I might just start crying right now. That whole song is really good. I recommend you check it out. I'll put the title to it here. Not only that, but the song was composed by Hiroyuki Sawano. Someone told me this in the comments. I did some digging and you're probably wondering, okay, that's awesome. But who is that? I was wondering the same thing. I looked it up. This dude also composed something from an anime you may or may not have heard of. It's kind of obscure. It's kind of small. Not a lot of people know about it. Um, It's called Attack on Titan. And, and if you're familiar with Attack on Titan, you might recognize this. This is him. Like, is the same, same, same. So no wonder another absolute banger. Okay, I got super sidetracked, but that scene was amazing. The music was so good. It was my favorite part of that episode. So thank you guys for letting me know in the comments. I'm so happy I got to look into that. Before we begin today's episode, per usual, you guys know I am repping one of my merch designs. This is part of the newest collection. I'm obsessed with the sleeves. This is one of my favorites for the new drop. I feel like I say that all the time, but I am the one making these designs. So I'm a little biased and I obviously really like every single one of them. Except for, I don't want to talk about it. My entire shop idea is like subtle, minimalistic anime merch. So that's your cup of tea. Feel free to check it out. You guys know where to find it. Shopcosco.com and the link is down below as well. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And without further ado, let's get back into solo leveling. Is <laughs> this guy? Oh shit, they're investigating. Oh, that's suspicious. Okay, he's not interested. Okay, he's not interested. <laughs> He's so cute! What happened? He got hot! Uh oh. Oh, so it's his younger brother that's the infamous one. Oh, sh he's still thinking about that. Bro, I love that he doesn't just brush it off! Like, he sounds just like. <laughs> I don't know, he says he, it doesn't matter, but he still looks kind of depressed a little bit. What is happening? Ha <laughs> ha No! Is that because he was drinking? Bro, it's literally... <laughs> it's resetting him when he drinks! I'm yelling. It said no drinking. Whoa! Ah, uh, so the alcohol would be considered, <laughs> like, toxic, obviously. So it just resets. Yeah! Okay, relax. It's fine. I'm not. I'm not. I don't care. Okay, who even cares? Just Gino. <laughs> I'm so happy. I was afraid they weren't gonna be friends. <laughs> still calling him Aniki. <laughs> he looks so tiny outside of his armor. Oh my god. Please! Please! 
Damn! Oh wow! Please, he would be such a good guild master with some experience. Yes! Come on! Okay, so those are the prereqs. Doesn't quite have that experience, huh? That is a good business model. An S rank? Uh, that's not you, Pookie! <laughs> 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 that's smart. Oh, he's kind of... He's kind of strategizing this. And it's going to make him look good because no one's going to think it's Jinwu. 30 billion! 30! He doesn't... He's like, uh, yeah, I could probably get that whatever. Higher than S? You're just gonna become a god at some point? He said no! No! Is he threatening him? Is he threatening him? Pookie! <laughs> don't do that. I don't know. That was a good move. No! I wanted them to be buddies! He shouldn't have said that! Oh? Uh-oh. Oh no. Okay, the revenge arc begins. I can do it. <laughs> Not him plotting murder immediately. Yikes. They said, welcome back to how to get away with murder. <laughs> Put it in the calendar. Get revenge for brother. Murder. <gasps> no! I know Jinwoo can fend for himself, but if they go after Jinwoo... I swear, I swear to God! You know, this doesn't seem this doesn't seem good. Look at that healthy sibling dynamic. Imagine that in an anime. Oh, he's thinking about that 30 billion. Huh? Extra credit? He's just gonna test and see how high it goes. Remember when he almost died trying to do the exercise routine the first time? It cuts off at double. It doesn't let him do more than that. I lied. I didn't do anything. Okay, it did. Of course it did. Cur okay. Oh, the sun. Wonderful. Is that a key? Oh, another dungeon key. A demon's castle. Yes! <laughs> Elixir of life. <laughs> Elixir of life? What the? There's no way. Immortal. Oh my god, he would use it for his mom. Oh, he's so good. I thought he was just planning to become a god or some statue titan at some point in time. Like, he's just gonna keep upgrading. Nah, he still cares about his family. That's so. I gotta remember, that's his priority right now. It doesn't matter how strong he gets. He's actually going into the S dungeon. That's brave. When he goes into these, he can't leave without beating the boss or teleporting out of there somehow. He said, do I even have a chance? And then just walked right into it. This is hell. So that's crazy. He just walked into a gate to hell. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. He's not, he's not stupid. <laughs> oh, he has a way out. He wouldn't have gone in here without that, I guess. Cerberus, cute. It, he, he is in hell. Hell's gatekeeper. Damn, I'm crushing the game. I should be the narrator. Come on. Dash. <laughs> I love this skill. He just teleports. The eyes. Oh. Damn. Oh, it got canceled out. It said, I don't give a fuck if you want to kill us. Oh. All, none of his special powers are working. That's not great. <gasps> oh! Fuck. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ow! God! Okay. Pause! I think his arm's gone! It is! Okay, I hope that, uh, regrows. It's, ab its abilities are gonna be doubled. Okay, See, this is when you leave! This is when you leave! Oh. Uh... 
why isn't he leaving? Why is he gonna try to fight this? Oh shit, okay. I never doubted you. Okay, I doubted you a little. Jean Woo. Jean Woo! Is that hit? Okay. That's a lot of blood. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. You're dying, just so you know. In case you, you, you're not reading the meter there. You're dying! Girl, leave. His health is so low. Yeah, he's gotta leave. Oh, fuck. Oh, he's so fuck. Ah! I'm stressed. Okay, no, he's the main character. Where's the plot armor, Jean Wu? Where is it? God, I'm sweating. <laughs> Why did he go in here? Poison? Because he'll heal from it, right? What? What is? Is it gonna reset everything? Wait, that's so fucking smart. Is poisoning himself going to reset his whole health? Wait! Oh! Nelly! Okay, okay, okay. It's not raging anymore. He's gonna do it. Come on, Jin Wu. Come on! Damn, god damn! Oh, it's not good. Come on! That'll do it! That'll do it! Okay, Feral Jinwu. Feral Jinwu. Unlocked. He loves that dagger, huh? The eyes! <laughs> He's insane! I love it! Oh my god, he did it. Fuck me up! Easy! Light work! Okay, but is... But did he die? Damn, that was sweet. You got another key? Oh, the elixir of life. Oh. Oh shit. Okay, so he, he needs three ingredients for the elixir of life and they're here. In that castle. And then he can save his mom. <gasps> no! We all know, obviously, Jinmu is getting exponentially stronger at an extreme rate. But I did not expect him to already be able to reach an S rank dungeon. He's got the key to the castle now. He's got the elixir formula to save his mom. He just needs three items that are in that castle. I don't know if the gatekeeper's service was an S rank. It just had the red title. But I feel like Jinmu is upgrading so quickly that there's not even gonna be anything that's hard for him to fight anymore. That he's gonna get to the point that like every fight is light work. He's like, yeah, I'll probably get high Higher than S rank. Bro is planning on becoming Hercules? No. Mayhaps a god? Like, where do you even go from there? Putting that aside, he has his family he wants to take care of. His sister's going to school. His mom needs that elixir of life to live. But I just feel like once he does those things, like, that's not gonna be that hard for him to accomplish. Like, I feel like he's going to get rich very quickly. He's gonna get this elixir of life. His mom's gonna be saved. And then what? He's just extremely OP and has, like, no direction in life. Bro is gonna become a villain! I'm kind of leaping ahead here. So let's focus focus on what happened this episode. I'm really sad that Jinho asked Jinwu to be buddies, to team up, you know, so that he can get his guild license. And Jinho was just like, and then, Jinho, I love you, but I don't know where you found the audacity to tell Jinwu that if he joins and helps you out, you'll keep his secret. I was flabbergasted. I don't know that that kind of threat was the way to his heart. It didn't work out very well. But Jinho was talking to his sister and he was like, oh, hypothetically, if you had 30 billion, so I think he is still considering and, and next episode, they're going to be best of friends. You heard it here first, folks. I have been told as well that next week's episode is going to be a recap episode. So episode 8 won't be out until, what is it, March 2nd? In the meantime, I'm thinking about starting Ninja Kamui. So if you guys have seen that or have heard of it and you want me to react to it, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Stay tuned for the next episode of Solo Leveling and many more anime reactions. Don't forget as well, if you're interested in anime-inspired merch, you can find that in the link down below, shopkazuko.com. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Bye, loves!